ministry, Shambach Foundation, is doing work all over Costa Rica, but we heard when that there was a group of people in a place called Pavas. They're tired of the drugs, they're tired of the crime, and they're ready for a change. Not the change that man brings, but the change that the Holy Ghost brings. Hi, this is Donna Schambach, and I represent Schambach Foundation. We're here in Pavas, Costa Rica. In January of 2014, we came to explore whether this was the place God wanted to do a crusade. When I came in January and I talked to pastors who've been here for decades, they weren't bragging about numbers in their church, but they were weeping for their city, weeping for a fresh move of God. We're pinpointing February 2015. My team and another uh, evangelist from the States and a group of many missionaries, we're going to descend on Papa. We're planning a crusade, citywide crusade in the capital city of Costa Rica. Pabas is a, a suburb of San Jose. But I've come to announce we don't have to wait till February. I'm not believing for revival to begin in February of next year. I believe revival has begun right now. Just talking to a pastor right now, just confirming that what Donna has shared with us uh, today about the healings of salvation for the past four months. For instance, there was an example mentioned about a man who had died and he completely came back alive again. People that were, had no hearing were able to hear again. In our church, we have uh, too many people that was uh, drug addicts, alcoholics, and uh, uh, people that just got in troubles. I know that Jesus can change whatever heart. So no matter what, what happened with your life in the past. This might be a last chance for revival in Papa. I believe there can be a great awakening. What's your faith level? Say, God, I might not have much, but I'm investing in this crusade because this is my these are my soul. This is my revival. I'm giving you like the boy gave his luck so that thousands can be fed. People of God are beginning to believe that the dead bones of Pavas can live outside these walls where it gets rough, where it's dark, where people reject and cry, where drugs are sold on the street. Can these bones live? have a new life in Jesus Christ. Just believe in the world God. We're believing for great change in the town of Pavas coming Amen. in February 2015. Amen.